Hello and welcome to this video. In this video I just want to talk about an year in review. Uh, it, so it was last year in July when I had uh, my A+. Um, so I was just like one thinking about uh, oh I haven't done anything uh, the whole year and just last week I signed a sign in here so I saw all these and then I realized how much I did uh, study how much uh, hours and weekends I spent uh, studying so this was kind of uh, refreshing uh, you can see there's the A plus that was the first one I got uh, if I click here it should show the date July 17 so it was so the other thing that was even more um, um, assuring to me in terms of me thinking not hey I'm I didn't study or I did not progress there are four courses that uh, I studied this year they are not here because I haven't completed them yet uh, they are almost complete so it was just like a moment of uh, a pat on your own back uh, you can see I and this one uh, I got the this one was last August this one I, I did not get another one until January of this year got this one in April this one sometime in the, over the summer and I just got this in August so this was uh, I'm it, it's like relieving you're relieved of a uh, okay I did something I, I have something uh, the other four should show up here obviously you will not be able to see them until next year I'm gonna do this as a yearly thing where I will look up uh, and see what I've done um, the other thing is that if you if, if you want uh, it's like uh, years in review you can see and uh, what you've been through what you did what you worked on and it gives you uh, momentum to keep going uh, hopefully you will s uh, I'm working on some very exciting things I want to all show up here uh, if you're wondering how you get this uh, basically if you go to uh, uh, whenever you pass anything CompTIA that started with CompTIA when I passed it they sent uh, something in the mail to uh, in email to accept the badge that's when I did and then Evan since currently has it they send me an email and I just need to accept it that's it that's how they show up here uh, so apparently CompTIA, AWS, Google everybody has it uh, uh, integrated with them so whenever you pass something it shows up or they send you an email so and this is for uh, you guys like if you uh, if anybody is uh, like they're not sure how to do it or not to do it like there is a debate about uh, certification versus uh, hands-on definitely go for certifications uh, the, these it's you, you cannot pick one over the other it's always uh, glove and hand uh, you have to have both uh, it's like one foot uh, in front of the other or it's like a stair you get uh, some uh, experience then you have to go level up with the certificate then more experience so yep yeah, and especially for the HR HR loves certifications so your IT manager or somebody from uh, like uh, from your team who has technical background they will evaluate you uh, over your technical knowledge they will ask you questions and all that and obviously you will get some knowledge through these certificates other from the um, hands-on experience but HR they have no idea they they just put one certificate in the job description if you don't have it and somebody has it they throw your uh, application out the window uh, so this is uh, these are my thoughts for this year hopefully I will see you in the next year with uh, a lot more here um, until then, see you next year.